is up everyone welcome back to my channel please comment share like subscribe if any of this is resonating for you love all my subs y'all are so awesome thank you so much for hanging in there with me and, and for your encouragement uh, I just want to give you all a quick praise report um, so with the local jail that I go to um, just miracles happening but uh, I don't know if y'all remember but I kept on getting the word key, and this was a few weeks ago, maybe two or three weeks ago now. Um, I think I made that the title of one of these videos. But anyways, so I kept on getting the word key, right? And I was like, Lord, what are you trying to tell me about key? Well, the very next week, I went thrifting with uh, one of my gal friends, and we were looking, you know, through all these different clothes, and I turned to this shirt, and it says, I am the key on this shirt and I was like whoa and so anyways um, just trying to rest in the Lord and whatever he was trying to reveal there so anyways fast forward to today uh, I go to the jail with one of the gals for my Bible study and we're gonna go minister to the women in there and <laughs> this is so crazy so we had prayed and everything and then she has this little stack of papers and she's like hey I was thinking about uh, handing this out to the women and I was like okay so she's like trying to explain to me you know what's on the piece of paper and I just stopped dead in my tracks because the title on the paper is um, the person I guess the author of whatever article the author of the article his name was Daniel Key and I was like dude just stop what you're saying we're taking that in with us I don't care what that's on it but turns out man that it was uh, the prayer for salvation so you know it had Romans chapter 10 verse 9 um, and a few other verses that you know lead people to salvation And no one can draw us until, unless the Father, you know, draws us in. We can't, you know, do it of our own sense and our own will, but the Holy Spirit, you know, is drawing them. So, anyways, um, that was all on that sheet of paper, all those scriptures. So, anyways, we go into the jail and we're praying. And we all pray this prayer together. And I'm not even joking. I'm pretty sure this one gal got saved. Like, immediately after we had prayed, she was like, I've never really read the Bible before. Where should I start? <laughs> it was nuts because um, it was just like the Holy Spirit, you know, quickened her um, into making that decision. And it was just so beautiful uh, that we could, you know, even be a part of that. So, all glory to God on making us a part of that because it's all by His will, His timing, His glory, His grace. So... I just, I mean, that's a huge praise report. Like, anytime someone is saved, that is so beautiful and um, just a mystery, you know, wonderful uh, gift from the Lord. So, just praying for that gal and uh, that the Lord will continue to grow her in knowing Him, you know. And then, at the end of our time uh, with the women at the jail, uh, we were all praying dude like they can testify to this and my friend can as well but we were praying and I felt something like there was a gal to my right and all of a sudden I felt something like pulling my hand and it wasn't her it was not her at all and so I just kind of discounted it because I was like you know what weird stuff happens maybe she like twitched her hand you know something like that but she looked at me after the prayer and she was like astonished and she was like did you feel something trying to rip my hand away from your hand and I was like yo that's crazy so um we ended up praying over her and um you know just continuing prayer for her but it's it's interesting too because um whenever I met her too like her countenance it just looked dark um there's a darkness over I mean, she knows the Lord, though, so it's interesting, you know, just the the things that the Lord delivers us from, even if we are in Him and in the kingdom. So, yeah, I just continue prayers for her, but it was just so, I, don't, I can't even describe it. It was so cool just to be able to witness that, you know, 
And again, these are um, first-hand accounts. Um, you know, I'm recalling them to the best of my ability, but this is not smoke and mirrors. This is not a joke. Um, I would never joke about um, an act of God. You know, there is uh, there's no place for that really. <laughs> Yeah, I love y'all so much. I am praying for you all. 